Assalamualaikum viewers. Hope you're doing well. I'm back with another video. Welcome to Expert Tech. Today I'm going to show you the camera samples of that S21 Ultra. I'm using the Google Cam, and uh, I will compare the Google Cam with their stock cam, and uh, I will show you the camera samples, uh, portrait photography. I will I will show you the photo portrait photography and the video photography, videography of that uh, camera. And uh, before starting the video, do hit the subscribe button. And um, the great thing is that. I'm using the uh, S21 Ultra to uh, capturing the this video, and the blur is uh, the video is taken by this uh, their main camera, and I'm using the portrait uh, video with 3x, and you can check the uh, background blur and everything. So the camera sample is very amazing on that one. But uh, we will compare uh, the Google Cam how they perform they better than that uh, stock cam. Is it any Samsung improve their camera or not? So. In this video, I will show you deeply which one is uh, bet capturing better dynamic range and better uh, exposure and everything. So let's start the video. So guys, as you can see, you now the left one is GCam and the right one is taken from stock. So detail is very good in GCam, uh, but portrait is good in the uh, stock cam. This is the 3x portrait uh, with those with both of cams. So this is the 2x uh, GCam with the uh, stock. Let so you can see the dynamic range and everything is good but you can manually add the blur on gcam as well uh, let me show you the some editing pictures after editing these results are coming from that uh, gcam and from the stock so you have to better judge which one is uh, producing more or uh, better image let me uh, check the different this is a 3x portrait as you can see the details and everything is good stock is uh, capturing more blur this is the 1x uh, the gcam which is the stock stock is capturing more uh, portrait and this is the 2x so both results are amazing but google cam is capturing more details see this is another example this is gcam is capturing more detail as compared to stock stock is just editing the feature but gcam is capturing more more details so this is the user friendly experience so who wants the detail or who wants the beauty this this is a gcam and what's a stock cam see the detail on gcam is very good this is another example of one export of gcam and the stock Gcam is good, very good at all. So this is the, the simple chip picture showing on your screen. This is more example of Gcam. So these all are the taken from Gcam of the S21 Ultra. This is another example uh, of Gcam versus. So this is the uh, camera sem videography sample of that uh, S21 Ultra. But we are now using Google camera. So see the stabilization and everything. Uh, see the dynamic dynamic range. I'm right now. Uh, shooting video on direct sunlight so see the results uh, let me just uh, showing the show the, just me show you the focus samples of that in videography how they uh, focus the uh, object uh, so whenever we uh, uh, just close the from object so the due to big aperture on samsung s21 ultra they automatically uh, add bokeh on the back side of subject so this is the good thing that Samsung is using for a very big aperture. So again, as you can see the uh, Gcam results. But one thing, Gcam have no stabilization on video section as compared to stock. Stock have more stabilization. This is the stock camera. So see the dynamic range and everything on the stock camera. Uh, you may check the stabilization. I'm just running. I'm just walking around. Uh, on, uh, but the camera is still uh, uh, maintained. So the thing is that the stock camera have more stabilization because Gcam is the modded one and the stock is actually optimized for their camera. So this uh, the S21 Ultra stock cam have a very good uh, optimization on stabilization but Gcam is also good not that at all. So let me show you the some front cameras. This is the 4K uh, videography samples of that S21 Ultra. So see the stabilization and everything. Uh, you may check the results. Now I will show you the Google camera. Uh, this is the S21 Ultra main camera with stock camera we are using. So let me just uh, walk away from that location. So you may better check the dynamic range and everything. So see the dynamic range and uh, my uh, can, and I'm right now shooting that video on direct sunlight. So uh, let's uh, let me just walk uh, faster. So you may check the stabilization and each and everything. So see the stabilization and you have to better judge which one is good and now i will show you the 4k uh, video or uh, graphy samples of that 
S21 Ultra, uh, Google and what is the stock. So this is the uh, front camera of uh, S21 Ultra but we are using Google Cam. So you see the uh, results and each and everything. Let me just uh, move in and uh, show you the, some stabilization, how they perform their duty. So the results are taken by their uh, Google Cam. So let me just walk uh, away from that location. So see the, I'm um, just uh, walking. So see the stabilization and each and everything and i will show you the now the s21 ultra stock camera so this video is capturing with the 4k and with auto resolution of that google camera i'm using google camera uh, you may check the focus and everything uh, so this is 4k with auto resolution and uh, let me show you the original camera sample though with 4k uh, with uh, resolution 4k with 30 and 60 this is the stock cam uh, with 4K resolution and uh, you may check the focus and everything. Uh, it's capturing very easily focus uh, and uh, if I tap on it, selectively focus, it's uh, doing very great job. So the camera, this is taken by the stock cam. Uh, one more thing I will add that uh, it supports all 4K uh, cams. This is the ultra wide, this is the 1X and this is the 3X and all are supported uh, 4K resolution. I have to uh, just uh, move out from this section. So see, this is the 10X. All their cameras, lenses are supported 4K. So this is the very good thing. So uh, let me uh, show you the full HD samples of that Google cam and of their uh, original camera. Video sample of that. So this is the video sample of that Google camera at full HD auto optimization at the auto means uh, it will automatically optimize the frame rates according to situation, according to weather and according to lightness. This is the full HD auto optimization on the full back camera of S21 Ultra stock camera. So this is very good. No doubt Samsung and Google Cam are doing great job. But the Google Cam, I, I just noticed that Google Cam have no... Uh, uh, video stabilization and I'm just zooming the uh, main camera of that uh, S21 Ultra. The stock camera supports 20x zooming but the Google cam supports only 8x. It's zooming. So results are very good. Let me show you some front side. This is the front video samples of uh, the S21 Ultra with their um, Samsung camera. So this is right now this is full HD auto. Uh, let me uh, came out from my home and uh, I will show you the uh, how they capture uh, in uh, on sunlight in sunlight and the direct sunlight and uh, uh, stabilization everything you may check uh, uh, clear results so this is uh, the front facing camera of the S21 Ultra with this stock cam so this is the results and uh, everything it will auto optimize the frame rates and everything uh, according to weather so uh, let me uh, show you the Google cam samples. This is the uh, Google cam uh, front video recording samples. So uh, I'm using the same camera, same phone, and uh, see the dynamic range first and uh, see the um, background and everything, uh, the stabilization and each and everything. So this is the Google cam and the front facing camera. Guys, so, this is for today, and uh, you check the results of that Google cam. The, they're capturing the very uh, like the photos came out from the google cam the processing is very good and the portrait and the detail everything is very good i would suggest you can use the uh, uh, google cam for the portraits for 2x and uh, the stock cam is not bad uh, you can uh, use amazing features that 100x zoom and everything so this is for this video is for today and uh, i hope you like my video i will mention the google this google cam uh, link on my description I will inform you one more thing that uh, that google cam doesn't support the front portrait and front photo that only supports back portraits and back photo and uh, front videography is also supported and back videography is also supported so if you like my video do hit the subscribe button